the final episode of the first season of the comment section show. Welcome to What You Said. My name is Larry Shonubi. Once again, welcome to What You Said. It's the final episode, but I am not going anywhere. On the show today, I have the top five videos of the week, um, you know, from the episode that we've had. I played a couple of videos for you guys, or I've given you a couple of videos. So we'll be taking the top five videos, and I'll be taking the top three stories on the show. Also today on the show, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> we're announcing the winner of the giveaway. Let's go straight into it. Let's not waste each other's time, because we need to focus. In the video of the week, holding it down at the number five spot, ladies and gentlemen, is the Kubasa Choir. I really like this video because, I mean, it's really creative. You guys should check out more of their videos on Instagram. At the number four spot, ladies and gentlemen, is Tony Onion. This video actually cost or brought about or brought to birth a new word. Tony Onion. <laughs> Enjoy. I know what the guy did. The car, the car is just Tony Onion. I don't know what the car did to this car. The car is Tony on his own, man. All right, holding it at the number three spot is, uh, <laughs> check this out. CDC Power. Fee fee. Enjoy. The number two video that really blew my mind throughout this season is this video of a child praying. Ladies and gentlemen, I really could not hear, and I'm sure you guys cannot hear what she's saying, but I'm sure that God in heaven, who is a real father, can hear what she's saying. This is the number two video of the week. Or what you say? So a quick rundown of the videos that have blown our minds in the first season of what she said, the videos of the week. Number five is the Kubasa Choir. Number four is Tony Onion. Number three is the PDP Rally. And number two is Ladies and gentlemen, this video really shook us. This video swept us off our feet, literally. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is the leader of the APC doing his thing. Ashiwaju Ahmed Bolatinubu. Enjoy. <laughs> Let me see your hands up. It's a broom. Broom revolution. Broom, 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 broom. 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 Right, that's it for the top videos of the week on what she said. Now let's go into top three stories that really blew our minds. Number three story is Mabajide Songolu, definitely. I mean, why won't we have Songolu on this countdown, ladies and gentlemen? Mabajide Songolu was everywhere during his campaign and now he is the governor or governor elect of Lagos in Nigeria. Um, so they had to make an app during his campaign and your reactions to this app definitely made it to what she said. Holding the number two spot is Blackface, ladies and gentlemen. Blackface featured twice, twice on what you said. First, it was just majorly about him, you know, calling out Two-Face and being all bitter and stuff. He didn't stop there. He came back again with a hit banger, hit track song. Ladies and gentlemen, your reaction to this story made this story what you said what. <laughs> All right, so this number one story, I'm giving a shout out to Saeed. He's one who is always editing these videos. Big shout out to Saeed. Give Saeed a round of applause if you are watching this video. Come on, clap for Saeed. Amarachi, clap for Saeed. All 
All right, so Saeed picked this story as his favorite story of all time on what you said, even if he has not seen the stories that are to come. Hmm. But here is Saeed's number one story on what you said. Ladies and gentlemen, would you become a house elf for 250,000 naira? Hmm. Think about it. Let it sink down your brain. 250k to even travel abroad. That is our number one story. Yes, so we know or I know that some of you really like the show and I really appreciate you all for watching the first season of the show. Don't worry, season two will be more inclusive as I will be doing, you know, introducing you to some stuff, but just hang in there. This is what you guys really had to say about what you said. The comment section show. Yo, what you said, what you said, yo, what you said season one was great. It was funny, it was... Very interesting, 7 to 10 minutes of every time I watch it, you know what I mean? Season 2 is coming! And I'm sure it's gonna be greater. Cause Lan Rishunubi doesn't come back the same way. To the What You Said team, thank you for great content and the great personality which is Lan Rishunubi. It has been an amazing season 1. Thank you so much. Hi guys, my name is Dolapo and I'm a fan of what you said on Tech City YouTube channel. It is it's a show hosted by Larry should be a very interesting and informative show and it is also very 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 hilarious. Yeah, it cracks you up every time I watch it and also keeps you updated about what's going on in Lagos and also in Nigeria. And it's also really short. I always look forward to watching every single episode and I'm really 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 looking forward to season two of what you said. Well done Larry. So I just want to give a big, big, big congratulations to what you said for finishing their first season. I can't wait for season two. Can't wait to see Larry finally sit down. And I'm so excited for what the show has to bring. Gracias. Thank you very much for watching this first season. Now it's time for us to do this giveaway. Onye, are we ready? Do we have a winner? Do we have a winner? Ah, oh, Onye, you're supposed to have done that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we need this, the winner picker. Do we do we have a winner? Let's see. You're we supposed to have been doing it as we are recording. Anyway, <laughs> you said what? Oh my God, guys, it is well. Oh. And you know when you actually have plan that okay, oh, girls, you don't want to give you poor girls, and then. Same who? Oh my goodness. We can't wait to give out this transformer. It, oh my god. <laughs> Let me just get here. We should wait for you. Let's do praise and worship. We bring the sacrifice of praise. While we are waiting for Una into the house. Okay, no. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's talk about this tower of Babe. <laughs> This is the Tower of Babel, ladies and gentlemen. As you can see, his features are real. Up here, it's at three points. It can gun you down. <laughs> ah, ladies and gentlemen, finally we have a winner of the giveaway on what you said. Please write the name down so we can announce. Please make him eligible, bold enough so people can see it. Mm. Okay, so as I was saying, big shout outs to Mr. Benga, big shout outs to Said. Hey, Said, all the stress that we went through, don't worry, season two, we'll go through more stress to make this show a better one. Big shout outs to everyone who, you know, made this show you know, possible. And you, don't worry, you can you can come on the set. No, don't worry, go back, go back. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the I'm shouting. I mean, <laughs> but the winner of the giveaway is. Ayobami Okolawon. He is the winner. Ayobami, so what we'll be doing is we'll be sending you a message on how to pick up your giveaway or how to pick up your gifts. So stick around. Or sorry, keep watching what you said. I hope you really watch what you said, really. As in, did you watch what you said? Ayobami, who has the question? <laughs> but congratulations to you and congratulations to everyone who applied as well. I mean, like they always say, everybody is a winner. I don't know why they say that, Shad, but <laughs> everybody's the winner at the end of the day. Thank you guys so much for watching what you said. Have a blessed life. Have a great life. I don't know what I'm saying now. But I'm not sad. Day two, you get to be the poor. <laughs> <laughs>